I'm Adela Geary. I'm from New York, originally from New York. I've always been a collector of art. So like my house in New York literally looked like uh, a gallery. So when I came here and I saw this building, I thought, wow, this would make a great gallery. And I get to live my you know, love of art for real. I get to live it every day. <laughs> What I wanted to do was bring art from other parts of the world and other parts of Mexico. I want to kind of bring a taste of other places to Merida. And so that's why I call it Artist Without Borders. Well, when customers walk in here, I'm hoping that they see happiness. I want people to walk in and look at the art and smile. When people walk in, they see art that brings emotion in it. I think our gallery is a place where people gather to, to connect with each other. And to me, that's very important to have a connection with people and art. I like to pick artists that are um, emerging, so younger artists, they're just I mean, we have very well-known artists, but I like to bring in emerging artists. My philosophy is one, art should be affordable for people and should bring a smile to their face. Almost every one of the artists we have in the gallery have inspired me. There's, I don't think there's one that hasn't. I I've been most inspired by my um, connection with Cuban artists. The life that they live there, the fact that such unbelievable talent comes out of that country, which has got a lot of problems, <laughs> um, is, is really inspiring to me. And so when I went to Cuba and I went to the artist's home, I was completely touched by how they're living. The, and the less known artists are not living very high on the hog, and yet, their art is just so amazing and their openness to inviting me in their home was amazing. I'm inspired by young artists, um, like Jar is, um, Jorge is one of our artists from Mexico City and every time I meet him I'm inspired. I'm inspired by his passion for art or Erico, you know, who is a local artist and he um, you know, he'll write me sometimes at two, three in the morning that he's working all night. I mean, that's, how can you not be inspired by that? Or we had one artist from India who was like 80 something years old, you know, and he had more energy than like I have. And he, you know, he's traveled the world and he does, he's just an amazing artist. So I think all of the artists are inspiring in their own way. What we want to do is bring art fashion and food together. So we're gonna be working more towards incorporating all the senses and that includes doing some things that might um, include meditation and yoga, food, art. Um, so we wanna kind of experiment with that. Um, so that's what's next. Art has a lot to do with, with that feeling of connecting and wellness and meditation. So I, that's really it. I think we're just at the beginning of some really incredible works and exhibitions that have yet to come to Merida.